show you how to cut up a pineapple the Hawaiian way. We went to Hawaii a few years ago back in 2017 and uh, we just had a blast and we went to the Dole Plantation and they showed us the proper way to cut a pineapple and to know when it's ripe and all that. So I'm going to show you. I went to Walmart and they had uh, some pineapples on sale uh, for two dollars and so um, we love pineapple especially Christopher and I so okay this pineapple is from Puerto Rico um, obviously it's not gonna taste as good <laughs> as Hawaii but uh, hey okay the way they showed us to know a pineapple is ripe is when you can take one of these top leaves right here and just pull it out See how easy that was? So when the leaf just pulls out like that, you know this pineapple is ripe. If you have to tug and tug and tug, then your pineapple is not ripe. Okay. Now the way to get this top part off, uh, off of this pineapple is not to cut it, but to twist it. See, it just, it just twists right off if it's done. Now this one doesn't have a very strong smell, um, but oh well. Okay, and while I was there at the Dole Plantation, the Dole Plantation is on the main island of Hawaii, and uh, we got this pineapple knife. And I love this pineapple. I wish I would have bought several. Actually, I think I did and gave them away. But this is a wonderful knife, and I take really, really good care of it. And you talk about sharp. Okay. The way that you are going to cut this pineapple. They had a little demonstration set up there. And uh, it was, uh, you could watch them and then you could test them. And let me tell you something. The pineapple in Hawaii is so much better than the ones you buy here. Uh, we bought several and, and just kind of went back to our room. We were there two weeks, so we were there, uh, or 10 days, we was there 10 days, and we would just snack on them all the time. Now, uh, someone told me before we went, they said, I said, a pineapple's a pineapple. She said, no, it's like having a garden fresh tomato versus a store-bought tomato. So, <laughs> It was true. But the way you're going to do this is you're going to cut right down the middle of your pineapple. Just like this. Okay? Right down the middle. And then we're going to do that again. Okay? Just like that. Okay. Now, this is where you're going to use your doll knife. Actually, we're going to do it one more time. You want a, you want a really sharp knife when you do this. Because that core is hard. So quarter it. We had so much fun. Uh, most of y'all know I homeschooled my sons. We used a Becca, um, a curriculum from uh, Pensacola, Florida. And, um, and so, you know, when you homeschool, you miss out on prom and stuff like that, that, that you don't, you know, get to do. So we, um, decided to take them on any, where, anywhere they wanted to go in the United States. <laughs> and so my son picked Hawaii. He goes, mom, it's in the United States. So what you're going to do now is you're going to just do this. See how I'm doing that? You do it as close to those eyes as you can. Just like that. Okay. And then you can just see where that core is and just take it off just like that. All right. Now I know Pampered Chef, they sell a core 
and I have not tried one of those, but um, they look like they're easy. So I'm sure there's several ways. This is just the way they taught us. Okay, the next thing that she said was very important, have a bowl of water. Just dip it in there just like that, and then just put it to the side. That gets rid of a lot of the acid that upsets your, your stomach or makes, you know, um, ulcers or whatever like that. So we're just going to continue. Now, her knife, let me tell you something about her knife. Her knife was bowed like that because she had done so many pineapples. And she said the, the more it gets that way, the better. So, and she actually went like I'm going from the other side. She just went like that and did the whole thing. Okay. For some reason, I just haven't conquered that yet. And then we're gonna take off that that core. Did you know that you, when you juice, you could you can use this core, and uh, you can still get the taste. I'm loving my juicer. All right, just like that. So I'm going to give you a few pictures from our trip. This is gonna be just a really short video. Um, from our trip and uh, Chris and I's uh, 25th anniversary is coming up next month and we had hoped to go back but with COVID and then with the stuff with mom we just were not able to so we're hoping to be able to do that next year and maybe by then all the craziness will be back you know will be gone so anyway all right this is how you cut up your pineapple we hope you enjoyed this video. If you have, give us a thumbs up. We would love to have you join our family. We'll see you next time. Bye.